And on any social media, I, I, I this it's guy antithetical to my beliefs. But here I am doing this. <laughs> Yes, hello GQ, I'm Nicholas Cage, what and today the... I'm going undercover on the internet. <laughs> it's actually me, it's, it's Nick Cage. Reddit. There is a subreddit devoted to you, have you heard of this? I heard about it. I did hear that Reddit has a sub something about me. You know what it's called? Yeah, I, I've heard about it, I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> Why not? That would be arrogant. What movie role would have been improved by casting Nicolas Cage? I can't answer that either because that would be arrogant for me to determine what I would have been better at than somebody else. Next, TL, wow, that Nicolas so Cage spent 150 million on a 70 million year old dinosaur skull. There's the skull I bought at an auction and I bought it legally. Here's the MacGuffin. When the Mongolian government said that they needed it back, I gave it to them, but I never got my money back. So somebody at the auction house should be in jail. T-I-L, Nicholas Cage and Gary Ullman were the original choices. Wait, you paid 150 mil for that shit? To play Harry Potter. Oh, that was a Lloyd. joke. Really? I didn't know that. I thought it was Jim from the beginning. I know Jim wanted me to be in it with him, but I wanted to do a little movie called Leaving Las Vegas instead. What would the most annoying sound in the world have sounded like, though? Want to hear the most annoying? Dude, dude, imagine making, making jokes off my net worth because of a fucking Google. Google doesn't know shit, man. Google doesn't know fucking jack shit. Sound in the world? Shut up, bitch. I don't know how to answer that. In 1997, Tim Burton wanted to make a Superman movie starring Nicolas Cage. Why can't they just make this now? Well, no I... matter how much time I appeared as the character, there might still be a chance. Posted. Nicolas Wikipedia. Cage, Superman? Well, Wikipedia is something that people go in and they change. Uh, any way they want. So I'm not sure all the facts are true in Wikipedia, but at 15 years old, Man, he, he tried knows. to convince his uncle Francis Ford Coppola to give him a screen test, telling him, I'll show you acting. That's in fact, yeah, that did happen. And I was met by silence in the car. Next. Jeez. For Birdie, in order to physically feel the pain of his character, Cage removed two teeth without any anesthesia. Yeah, anesthesia, yeah, that, that's a fact, but so you don't think I'm completely out of my mind, I had to pull the baby teeth out anyway. The timing of it worked out, it made me seem like a method lunatic, but huh? the truth is it was something I had to do anyway. Next. In February 2011, well, no, he, didn't he have realized to, that he had developed his own method of acting, but which I, he described as Nouveau Shamanic. He noted I mean, at some the point off the writer's anyway. Nouveau Shamanic is something I came up with because I like the French sound Nouveau. I thought it had a kind of a fun sound, meaning Guys, new. isn't there a Y at least like the teeth to the fucking thing? It's, it's, like, a, it's like a nerve or whatever. Is, is that is that like a, almost like a nerve or some shit? Is that new? I had read a yeah, book dude. called The Way of Weird by Brian Bates, and he was putting forth the notion that all Christ, actors, man. whether they know it or not, are recruiting the same instincts of the early shamans in the old villages from hundreds and thousands of years ago. And I like that idea, the idea of exploring your imagination. So that's where that came from. And have you written the book yet? No. But why no social media, though, dude? YouTube. Whoever thought that Nicolas Cage would play as Spider-Man? Well, Spider-Man Noir was great. I really enjoyed playing that part. I liked it because I was able to bring some of my own personal interests in the early actors of the 30s and 40s, like Bogart and Cagney, that were in yeah, all he looks pretty good. I'm films, I'm so impressed. that was fun for me. Yeah, I'm impressed. He, he, look, he doesn't look that much older than when he, uh, I watched the movies as, as a kid, like the Ghost Rider or whatever. He's yeah, it, 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 aging pretty well. do it, which is unusual. Replied. He's doing pretty good. This is the greatest casting of all. Yeah, but that that was something that didn't happen. This uh, Nicholas Cage's Joe Exotic, and it's probably just as well. It seemed like a fun character to play, but I have nothing in common with Joe Exotic. Cora. How did Nicholas Cage think about the decision to name his son Kalel? Kalel is a Hebrew name, and it means voice of God. It's also from a very famous character. I think it's a beautiful name, so that's why. Damn, the the, the Reddit is is one true God, and 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 is 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 
son is named a voice of God. In Ghost Rider, kind of, kind of a cool Cage's concept. ads are real, they are real, and that's why I will never work out that kind of hard cool again concept. because nobody yeah, wanted to believe they were real. They wanted to believe it was CGI, which it wasn't. So, oh, it's Superman. Oh. Has Nicolas Cage ever turned down a movie <laughs> all the time? I know that's not the urban myth you want it to be, but I turn him down all the time. 41 Twitter. Love the every Good one. Keep up Tattoo face off. Nichols Cage versus John Travolta. Winner. Oh, it's got to be Travolta. Ah, oh, come Travolta. on. Why are you so humble, dude? A speed round. Fave yeah. Nicholas Cage meme. I kind of like the vampire one right off the bat. This early picture of me. I like that because it's an early black and white picture. I think Jesus. it looks pretty cool. How do you feel about memes with you in general? What am I gonna do about it? It's there. TikTok. Bayzed? Wait, it, it isn't a huge social media, but that was a very Bayzed social media thing. No Felix, relationship with TikTok whatsoever. Understand. What was that? What was that? What was that? It can't be. It can't be. It can't be. It can't be. It I feel. I feel like. I feel like. Uh, 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 in, in the past years or whatever. Okay, Will Smith and and whatever have chosen to put a lot of things out in the public or whatever. And and, and what can you do? People are gonna meme about stuff. People are gonna say shit. Like, uh, you, you can't say that they've been memed on because of a lot of things, motherfucker. The the man went on an interview that's gonna be public and said shit like, uh, dude, I'm not, dude, like some fucking. Entanglement fucking bullshit, dude. Of course, this is gonna get meme. He's the meme now. Months, what about it, man? Oh, I think, think that would have been fast. If you do meme worthy shit, you're gonna get memed on. What can you do, to man? see someone else play me, which was my first suggestion, but they didn't want to go for that. They said they had to have the real me, whatever that means. So that's kind of interesting. Posted. Okay, that's it. I'm signing off. Thanks, man. Thanks, uh, Nicholas Cage. Hey there, Delilah, what's it like in New York City? I'm a thousand miles away, but girl, tonight you look so pretty, yes you do.